Hey, what up, y'all? It's your boy, Johnny. I'm gonna keep it real with you today. Today, I'm gonna show you six things that are ruining your style and your attraction. So I wanna shed some light to you guys so you guys do not have to go through the embarrassment that I have. So let's get right into it. Okay, so the first one doesn't exactly pertain to your style, but it can definitely dilute how attractive you are. And that is having bad skin. Listen, man, you can be the flyest dude out there. You can have the freshest cut and have everything else on point. But if you got like pimples all over your face, it's just not gonna have the same potency as if you had clear skin. Not only that, it's one of the biggest confidence killers. And because of that, that's going to make you less attractive because how are you supposed to show that big booty chica how confident you are? And yeah, man, she might be miring that outfit, but once she looks at your face, game over she's out so i've already got a video on this topic already that is linked down below i mean just look at me right now man i've got pimples all over my face right now because i've been stressed because of work and just life in general automatically i went from a johnny 10 to a johnny 7 because of how ugly my skin's looking right now all right the next thing that is ruining your style is not knowing how to color block so you can wear whatever you want this is style this is fashion it's subjective but there are just some outfits where it's just like ugh. What is this dude doing? So I'm going to break it down into three simple options that always work. So that is the monochromatic one. We've got the contrasting and we've got the solid. So monochromatic as in you stick to the neutrals and it's just different shades of that same color. And next we have contrasting colors. And so if you edit videos or photos, you'll know that the orange and the teal color grading is very popular. And that's because those are opposite sides of the color wheel. And also that is why you guys see me wearing the bread ones with olive green pants. Those are opposite sides of the color wheel and it just works. And then we got the solid colors. And with this, I would just stick with the all black look unless you're wearing suits. If you're wearing all white, I think that's doing too much, but you know, do what you want, man. Don't listen to some 22 year old kid yelling at a camera right now. I'm just kidding, keep watching my videos. That choice is yours. All right guys, the third thing that is ruining your style is having bad posture. So like having bad skin, having bad posture is going to ruin your confidence as well. However, having bad posture communicates confidence versus having bad skin will internally make you less confident. And that means your attraction level is going down. And it just looks weird, man. Like it's, it definitely looks like you don't want to be approached. So the next thing that's ruining your style is boxers. And I used to wear boxers. Come on, man. You know, the boxers move all over the place and you always have to adjust it. And if you don't, you're going to get this look. Now, I honestly think that having this look looks just as bad as having sweaty pits, which is a bonus style killer, by the way. And so I'm going to recommend these ones from Adidas. These ones don't slip, they fit perfectly all the time, no adjustments, and I'd highly recommend it. If you guys wanna cop these same exact ones, that link is in the description. I would definitely cop, man, it was a game changer for me. And yo, trust me, man, if you're gonna be playing some Monopoly with that big booty chica, you get that hotel on your boardwalk property, she's gonna see your ugly checkered boxes and she's gonna be out, she's gonna dip. So the next thing that's ruining your style and your attraction is that ugly ass wallet. Here is the one I've had for six years. Now my ex-girlfriend gave me this and I was just like, oh cool, this is a wallet. It works like a wallet and I never changed it for six years. And it seriously took me a few dates and some feedback for me to change my wallet. And man, I remember I was on this one day with this chick and she told me straight up, you need a new wallet. And I can tell she's a little turned off after I pulled out my wallet, but you know, your boy still got game, you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> but seriously, I switched to this awesome wallet right here and I get compliments all the time about where I got this from. And I never got that with that ugly ass Vulcan wallet. So I'm going to link this one down below in the description if you guys want to cop. I would highly recommend it. Yo, I even spend less money because I don't even wanna pull the money out of this. You don't have any bulges when you're wearing pants with these. Just cop one, man. Now moving on to the next style killer is going to be your grooming. We got clean shaven, a stubble, or full grown beard. Those are the only three options. You know, I know some of you guys are in the middle of growing your beards right now. Salute to you, man. I can grow a maybe a few hairs, but just know it's going to kill your swag a little bit. So if you want that beard look, just understand that your face is gonna look a little funny. But it's not just facial hair, fellas. Get your hair cut. Trim your nails, trim your nose hairs, make sure you got nice smelling breath. If not, get some gum. It's the little things that people are gonna notice right away. Nothing is worse than shaking hands with a dude that has ugly gross fingernails with dirt all over them. This guy's nose hairs pointing out. Come on, man, trim that sh what is wrong with you? All right, fellas, I hope this helps you out. Honestly, I don't want you guys to experience what I did, man. This is real world experience. I've gone through this, man. I don't want you to do that. I'm trying to help you out. So anyways, if you guys found this video helpful, be sure you let me know by hitting the like button. Go and follow me on Instagram and subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. Also, leave your comments down below on what other types of videos you guys want to see. And until then, stay fly and I'm out. Peace.